I'm Chef Kelly, and this is what I do. So Chef Kelly has concocted a couple of really good recipes that we should not be afraid to try when it comes to our party, right, Chef Kelly? Yes, you know, I think it's so funny. We spend so much time, like, thinking about food and agonizing about what we're going to serve, and then, yes. like, we put pop on the table. Right, right, like, two later. Cheers! <laughs> and some ice. So, right. You know, what I'm saying is maybe think ahead of time about maybe some fun beverages, some maybe that have some cheer, perhaps some non-alcoholic things. Yeah, we and had a punch. the kids, you yeah. know? Yeah. We had a punch here the other day for our little uh, work Christmas party. It was delicious. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they're so sweet and, and not good. So, I, I, I mean, I, I don't think you should overlook the punch bowl. That's not necessarily outdated you know and a thing of the past. Punch is back. Punch is back. Punch you hear is that? back. You heard it here on Fox News <laughs> All right. this morning. Yes. All right, so let's first talk about, um, like, maybe hot cocoa or coffee. I think you can make, like, a whole beautiful table out of hot cocoa. Yeah, this is my kind of hot cocoa. Right, so I brewed up a little bit of um, organic cocoa with my favorite Calder's Dairy whole milk. Whole, whole milk. milk, Dina. This is going to be nice Just and do creamy. It. Just and do look, it. And look, even in, does it really come in this glass it bottle? It really comes in the glass bottle. That is so and then fun. And you're supposed to bring it back, but I keep mine. I put water in them. I make my iced tea in them. So. That's nice. Where do you get that? I'm sorry, Calder's. I have like 30 of your bottles. Uh, I got that at Paul Market. Okay. Okay. So here we go. Hot cocoa. This could be for adults. This could be for kids. And I think it's kind of fun to remember the kids. You know, nah. Like, no, remember you're the kids. Right. You're right, of course. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go ahead and dip the glass. I just rimmed it with a little bit of orange. Can we give the kids the glass? Well, we can do paper, too, but then okay. it's harder to rim. Yes. Okay, so we're going to rim the glass, and I'm going to just go ahead and look at how rich that cocoa is. Oh, that does look good. And he has the candy, so we're calling it candy cane cocoa. Mm-hmm. So this, this is just candy canes that you... Um, yeah, I just crushed them up. Crushed them up with a like little hammer Like in the food processor or, or okay. a little hammer, like with the bottom of a pan. Okay. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to top my cocoa with a little bit of whipped cream. That is making my mouth water looking at okay. that whipped cream. Okay, let's just talk about real whipped cream. It's not that hard. You just put it in your little mixer for like a minute with some powdered sugar. Doesn't, doesn't the beaters have to be at a certain temperature and all that? We always have the beaters in the freezer to make the whipped cream. Just, no? Just cold, cold, cold. A little powdered right. sugar, a little vanilla. Like, I don't know where everybody buys all that. All their well, we junk. like the spray container. Just real whipped cream, everybody. <laughs> I right. know, you can't beat the taste of real whipped cream. Okay, so right. little chocolate shavings. And if it was for kids, I might even put a few holiday sprinkles. This is, this is for our kid named Roop. Roop. He's our tall kid. Here's a cocoa for you, Roop. <laughs> right. so good. Okay, now real quick before we go to our martini. Yes. Oh, now, you could add Bailey's, you could add Cointreau, and mm -hmm. here's the coffee here. So all this could be coffee and cocoa. Don't forget about your hard sugar sticks. And how about a candy cane stir stick? That oh. is so cute. Crazy cute. That is. All right, if it was cider, I'd put some of those in. Okay. All right. So Do you know? Go. Here's what it Martini. Looks like. Are you We're up for it? To root. Yep. Still, here you go, I mean, that just, That's like everything that like you'd ever want. It's a very, it's very, like Christmas in a glass. It's all right. Christmas in a glass. Seriously. That's, that's it's like the whole party, the whole kit and Okay, Dina, okay, let's rim our um, martini glass. What, what are these little tiny oranges called? They're little baby cutie patootie oranges. Okay. Little baby mandarin guys. Those are so All right. And this is just some like basic sugar. Actually, it was my cookie sugar that I had left over, and I put a little bit of um, white sugar in with it, too. Look how pretty. Oh, you've done this before. That's nice. That's I could just serve water in that. Isn't that impressive? <laughs> All right. So okay. we'll move the sugar, and yes. let's take some of the pomegranate juice. So yep, some yep, palm. Yep. It's going in the shaker? Shaker. Or in the glass? And, nope, shaker. Okay. How much? Just a pour, 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 pour. Okay. A little shot of vodka. All right. Some gray goose. Good. Oh, sorry. You, you like your martinis like well, I do. No. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's put the top on. Oh, okay. So okay. That's it. That's all that goes into that's our it. pomegranate. That's it. And ice. Okay. okay. Hold it tight and shake it up. All right. Ooh, lots of ice in there. All right. Okay, let's take it out. Let's strain it. Now leave some room at the top. Strain it in the martini glass. Put that on a pretty table. It's okay. It's okay. All right, that's good. All right. All Chef right. Kelly, I think I'd be at the kids' table. Finish the it with a little bit of the um, sparkling champagne. It's Sparkling like, champagne, yeah. just a dab. Just a dab. Just give a little bubble. Okay, look at that. And now these, you take the um, pomegranates. Mm -hmm. I love those things. And they freeze them so that they're like little ice cube bombs. In the oh, really? So sprinkle really? And that's kind of like says hi. Look at 
look at that. Delicious. That's Martini. beautiful. So that could be, you know, also, you know, certainly non-alcoholic. Right. Just like some, and on the website, they have a couple different recipes. I would be at the kids' table the entire there you time. Are. Is it chocolate? Chocolate. <laughs> it's so good. good. It really is really rich. It's like uh, only only 30 calories per glass, too. It's the whole milk. Dessert. Yeah, yeah, right. nothing wrong with whole milk. Nice. Thank you, Chef Kelly. Right, so thanks. when we come back, you're going to talk about... Gift baskets. Gift big, baskets. big, big. Yeah. All right. And for the drink recipes, more information on Pure Foods to You, <laughs> log on to MyFoxDetroit.com and click on the weekend page, Pure Foods to You. Coming up in our 9 o'clock hour, Chef Kelly is talking about those gift baskets, so stick around. Mm -hmm.